packages from Central Receiving, which are all the way on the other side of campus. So yeah, I just finished my two classes for the day. I'm gonna go pick up my packages, quickly try to get back to my room, prepare some lunch, and then I'm going to go work out after that. And then I have a GIS lab from three to four. So I have to kind of hurry and make sure that I have enough time to eat and work out. We have successfully delivered the packages. Alright, so for my pre-workout, I was going to have a clutch bar and this big thin quick oatmeal cup. And then when I get back, I will probably just have a little cup of yogurt with some fruit. Yeah, nothing crazy. from my workout and I think I'm just going to have an apple and maybe a yogurt cup with some strawberries. I'm not really craving something sweet but whatever that's like pretty much all I have so got an apple hopefully it is not bad and then this too good mixed berry yogurt and then I have some frozen strawberries I would usually have frozen blueberries, but I finished. But I finished those yesterday, unfortunately. Um, and then before I left, I just took out some turkey to defrost. It looks like it's pretty defrosted, so I might put this in the fridge. I'm gonna use that to cook for dinner later. Um, I have to have a quick dinner because I have a club meeting at 5:30. So I'm probably gonna eat before then. I have about 20 minutes until my GIS lab, which I'm excited for, but yeah, I will see you soon. Okay, so I um, decided to go to the local market afterwards because I needed some bananas and some Cheerios. So I just decided to buy some stuff. So I got some frozen blueberries, some chia seeds, which I really needed. I got some watermelon, which I'm really excited to have. And then I got a bell pepper for today, today's dinner, because I'm gonna make kind of like a stir fry. And then a big box of Cheerios, because I needed that. And some bananas as well. now pretty late at night well late for me it's like nine um and my meeting got out kind of late so um i ended up spending about an hour in the gis lab trying to get some work done but i still have a lot more to do and then i'm going to spend about 30 minutes finishing up the work I was supposed to do today because today was like super super hectic and I didn't have time to get much done and tomorrow is going to be worse because I have a four hour lab and then I have a night class and two morning classes so yeah um, I try to get all my work done pretty much early in the week and on the weekends so that um, I, have to, I don't have as much like work to do 
later on in the week because I know I don't have time. So yeah, I will try to do as much as I can right now and then whatever I can't finish, I will try to get done tomorrow, but I don't have a lot of time to work. So yeah, we'll see how it goes. Okay, so I just finished all my work. It is almost 10, almost my bedtime. Um, and I was also doing some planning for tomorrow. So I always plan for the next day before I go to bed. So I could just show you. Um, so I could just show you kind of what I was doing. So basically I have this book. I'm actually not sure what brand it is, but they give you a task list, a schedule, which I don't use because I use Google Calendar, um, a day review, an accomplishment section at the end of the day, and then you kind of have like a my goals section, top priority for the day, sorry it's not focusing, and any notes. Um, I don't really fill out the sections that much because um, I really just focus on the task list that I have. But yeah, it just really keeps me focused. And then if I have like um, a workout, I will also write that up as well. But I don't for tomorrow because I have, don't have any time. So Thursdays are my rest days. But yeah, it's also really satisfying to just check off everything that you have, especially when you have a lot of readings to do. So um, I already washed up, brushed my teeth, so I am just going to fill out my gratitude journal and if I have time I will read a little bit of a book, but other than that, um, that is the end of my day, so thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and yeah, this was a busy day, but honestly a lot of my days are pretty busy, so. I hope you enjoyed, got some insight into what it's like to be a liberal arts student, although um, honestly like all our schedules are so different, so I mean this was just one day for me and it doesn't represent every single day and it definitely does not represent every single student, <laughs> um, so yeah, this was just an example of one of my days, so thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.